All right, the Minnesota State Fair starts this Thursday, have you heard? And we can't wait to head out to the fairgrounds. Of course, a big part of the beloved summer tradition is the food. And this midday, we are counting down to the great Minnesota get together with some new mouth watering eats. This is Janine Holig. She is the chef at Hot Indian Foods uh, in Minneapolis. Hi. Welcome. I walked into the studio and I was like, oh, this is going to be a good show. Yeah. It smells <laughs> fantastic in here. That's our poll. And you guys are so popular at the fair too. People yeah. love you. We're super happy to be back. Yeah, where are you at located? We're going to be able to located in the International Bazaar on the east side. Love that So spot. next to one of our Midtown Global Market mates, which is uh, Holy Land. Yep. Manny's Tortas is also there. East Lake Brewery, which we're big fans of, <laughs> has some new beers out this year. Um, yeah, we're really, Produce Exchange has got their peaches going again. So yeah. us at Midtown Global Market, it's a pretty buzzing community right now. The International Bazaar is so easy to find too. It's great over yeah, there. I love it. Yeah, there's a lot of cool things to buy there and I like, the food is just so different. They got pork yeah. chops and all oh, they just got good stuff over there. I love it. Totally. So you guys have a couple new things this year at the fair. We have a couple new things. We have okay. our, our traditional, we have our, our old favorites, which is our butter chicken samosa and our, our sweet summer vegetable samosa. Okay. But this year we're coming in with a little bit of bang and a little more Indian Ooh. pizzazz. So one of the first things I wanted to put together for you is a really popular Indian street food, okay. and it's called Bel Puri. Okay. So we really wanted to bring some traditional flavors. It's really snackable, it's vegan. Um, it'll be really refreshing on a lot of those hot days. Perfect. So to start it off a little bit, we're gonna add a little bit of our tomatoes. Okay. A little bit of red onions. All right. Some roasted peanuts. And then we do some cooked potatoes that we season up. Ooh. They're kind of room temperature. This is kind of this whole snack is sweet, spicy, savory, mm -hmm. crunchy. Um, it's just really, really, really okay. popular. So we have some dried mango powder, which gives it a little bit of a sourness. Okay. And some chopped masala, which is just a really widely um, used spice in a lot of Indian snack foods. So I'm going to mix this up a little bit. Okay. And I'm going to have you dump all three of those in there. The whole thing? Yep. Okay. So this is our puri, pur and then we got some puffed rice. Oh, yeah. That's nice. All right. Yeah, and, and then, then this. Yep. Too. Great. Awesome. So then we're going to okay. stir this all up so you can already kind of see everything's coming oh, through. So yeah. we have a lot of different textures in this, which okay. is why it's another thing that's really popular and it's a lot of fun to eat. Mm -hmm. So lots and we of have colors. lots of colors. Like and that. then we do it even better. So we add Ooh. some herbaceous chutneys. Okay. So it kind of gets it to stick together and then we make a homemade tamarind so it's kind of sweet and mm. sticky. So again, it's just got it's just got worlds of flavor in this one. It's going to be really Great. Really fun out to the fair. So this kind of all sticks together. Okay. Are you excited to try it? I'm super excited to try this. This is going to be This one good. Isn't, isn't too spicy. Like I said, it's got a lot of like refreshing stuff okay. with the, the cilantro and stuff in. And then in mm -hmm. our green chutney, cilantro, mint, ginger. So this one too will add a little bit of, okay. a little bit of freshness to it. Okay. So once all it's right. all mixed together. So we're going to mix it do? fresh about every eight orders at a time. So okay. it stays nice and crispy. Do you want me to hold that? Uh, if you'd like to. Okay, can I do, yeah, I'll do the you honors. You do the honors, <laughs> yep. Oh. So then when everybody comes up, they'll have a little, a little okay. bit more so don't just spill on yourself. Oh, perfect. Be our first one. Okay, and then as I'm eating, tell us real quick what this is. So this is a new item for Hot Indian. We have a, a famous chicken tikka masala that we, we serve in the restaurant. Okay. So what we did for the fair is we're doing a Kentucky fried chicken sandwich. Okay. A little riff on that Kentucky fried. So what we have here is our seasoned, battered, fried, chicken thighs that we've drowned in our tikka sauce. Ooh. Oh my. So I'll make it kind of clean for you today. But yeah. Oh, little, by the way, this is fantastic what I'm eating yeah. right now. This is really good. <laughs> it's got a lot awesome. of good flavors, right? Yeah. And, and good, kind good of a crunch. lot of different craveability. Yeah. Good different crunch stuff. Yep. So we're going to add a little bit more of that sauce on Ooh. the fried chicken. And then we have a little slaw that we do quick pickled with some cumin, some onions, some cucumbers, and some cabbage. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think you're going to be my first stop at the fair this year. We'll be there. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be there waiting for you. Oh my gosh. So that's our Kentucky Fried Chicken right there. Oh, that looks fabulous. Yeah, and the Bell Puri. So we're really excited. We'll have some of our old favorites and some of our Indian sodas we're selling there and stuff. But awesome. we're really excited to have everybody out this year. Well, we're excited you came on the show today. Thank it's you. It's always nice to see you. I love to feed you guys. Good luck. Yeah, we love, we love it too. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. <laughs> All right. And good luck with the fair this year. You Thank guys you. will have a good time. I appreciate yeah. that. All right. And be sure to join us at the Care Barn starting Thursday. We're going to broadcast live from the fairgrounds daily. The Big Red Barn is located near the corner of Judson and Nelson. There'll be lots of fun guests, great food, uh, great giveaways, and the popular Penny Press will also be back. Also find out what's new at Health Fair 11 at that building too. The Minnesota State Fair runs August 22nd through September 2nd. We'll be back after this.